Here is another brain tumor. I think you could see that that's abundantly clear from this CT scan. And I think you could see, oh, I'm sorry, this is not a CT scan. This is an MRI. I think you can also see that this tumor pushes away the midline structure, the falcs, in other words, from the uh, right side to the left. This is a feature of any mass lesion of the brain. It's what they call shifting of midline structures. Here you can see that even this ventricle on the other side is shifted a little bit. Uh, this is a, a dense tumor. It is a fairly well-defined tumor. And let me tell you something. Meningiomas usually occur where there are a lot of meninges, like the fox, like the base of the brain, like the tentorium, wherever you have a lot of meninges and a lot of venous sinuses, which are surrounded by dural meninges, that's where you get meningiomas. And that's exactly what this is. It's a meningioma. Meningiomas are generally regarded as benign. They have a, the consistency of a super ball or perhaps a golf ball. They frequently can be rock hard with age and can have the consistency of a marble. They uh, are benign, but generally they can become very invasive of the surrounding structures. I knew a surgeon who once said, you damn pathologists tell us that the uh, meningiomas are benign, but damn it, they go through the brain, they go through the skull, they go through the scalp, and if you let them, they'd even go through your hat. Here is a microscopic view of a meningioma. And even though there's several different types, the vast most common type is basically a, a very fibrous-like structure. You can see it's also very, very rich in blood vessels. All these little streaks are blood vessels. And angiographically, it is a very, very, very uh, vascular tumor. In addition, there's something that is characteristic of most meningiomas, which this uh, slide is just loaded with. And it's a structure called a samoma body. A samoma body is a collection of tumor cells, these sort of fibrous looking tumor cells that have a world configuration. Uh, you could re recognize one here, you could recognize one here, you, to, you could recognize one here. To a lesser extent, you could recognize one here. But virtually any random place we go in this meningioma, you will see samoma bodies. They have a very distinctive characteristic appearance, often like you see them in the thyroid, which is why pathologists love to diagnose meningiomas, because they look so cute with these samoma bodies, and also because they can very easily uh, be curable through surgery, and also they don't metastasize, and they very rarely turn malignant. Uh, this is your classical, beautiful uh, meningi um, I'm sorry, samomat samomatous type of meningioma, and thank you very much.